Prince Charles will visit one of the Cumbrian towns most affected by the recent floods today. The Prince of Wales is travelling to Cockermouth, where he'll meet people involved in the rescue operation. Yesterday, he met residents in Workington, left isolated by the rising tide of floodwaters. Just a few miles away in Egremont, the people of Cumbria paused to remember a police officer who died trying to keep people safe. PC Bill Barker had been directing traffic across a bridge when it collapsed, sweeping him into the waters below. With the nearby Calver Bridge in Workington remaining closed because of fears it could collapse, the army started building a footbridge to reconnect communities cut off. Major Nigel Hindmarsh from the Royal Engineers says it's a tough task. We launch a nose out using rollers um, across the river and build it um, until it's established onto the far bank and then settle it down onto the abutments, onto the permanent abutments that it's going to sit on. A link can't come soon enough for people on the other side. They've been left isolated for over a week, as Prince Charles found out for himself. <laughs> After what they've had to go through, his visit was a rare moment of light relief. <laughs> I don't believe it. <laughs> it was a measure of the Cumbrian spirit, both here and in Keswick, as the prince switched on the Christmas lights yesterday evening. Despite so many going through such hardship, their spirits clearly won't be dampened. Three, two.